Hi guys, it's Kylie. So, I wanted to... So, this is my intro to a vlog of Scott and I going camping. And this will be my first time camping ever. We're also going to basically hide away from the coronavirus in the woods secluded in a tent. He's a manager of a restaurant. I'm a hairstylist. Both of our industries are the type of places. There's no way we can really work in this pandemic situation. So um, he got three weeks off. My salon is still up and running, but there's no way for me to do hair without hovering my head about a foot over anybody when they're in my chair. So I decided it was in the best interest, interest of everybody in my family if I just stay out of work for a little bit too. So we're going on a whole week long trip to also avoid getting my mom sick and just my, my parents in general. Yeah, so we're gonna go and explore wilderness. See you guys then. Scott hit a truck on the road, but the truck driver just drove away, so you know, no consequences, I guess, but it was just a scuff on our car. Um, it, it didn't even hurt the other car one bit. Just the little bit of the uh, black decal. Scott put that on, so he knows how to remove it and put it back on. Uh, so it's not a big deal. <laughs> but that was the first time we've ever hit someone in this car and in general together, so yeah. What did you say? Set up the tent. Okay. So, let's do it, do it, do it. Two separate tents. Aren't we supposed to put down like a tarp before we put the tent? You don't have to. We're going to be Hi guys, today I'm going to charge my crystals in this earth because I don't have moon water or lots of sunlight. So I'm going to do this right at the base of this tree so I know exactly where it is. Is this clay-based soil? I don't actually know, my love. I know the soil near my house is clay. Because if I dig just like four inches into the ground, it's all like this red clay. That looks like pretty rich soil to me. So guys, I actually don't really know what some of these crystals are. Um, my dad gave them to me and so I do have a huge crystal collection and I know what most of them are. I have adventuring, I have moss agate, um, I have all kinds of agate, I have fluorite, I have malachite, I have citrine, I may not have citrine, I have smoky quartz, I have topaz. This is sodiolite, this is rose quartz, this is rhodiolite, and I'm trying to figure out what this is. And these two seem like they could be some kind of agate. This looks like agate, but I don't know what this is. And it has a similar rippling effect to agate, and it's really soft, so a lot of agates are like super duper smooth. Not sure. I also have amethyst earrings. Okay, might be super wrong about this, but this is either fluorite or agate. I think it's probably agate. But I used to think that this was Amethyst, it's not, because of the little rings in it. I have another necklace that has opal. But these are just what I'm gonna 
berry for today to charge in the soil. Can I drop it in? Um, let's put it. This coal? I believe that is right at the center. Yep, perfect. Right in the middle, that's actually perfect. That's enough. Can that's... I add a little more? Yep. All right. We can add more. Okay, so now we pop those sticks over here. Once these get going, we'll throw some of these blocks on them. Yep, you could just start tossing things on now. Just anything that will burn. Pine cones in because they're like little grenades. She's gonna blow! So that'll burn just enough. There we got a fire for the night. Yay! We're just throwing all the little pieces of firewood. Just trying to get this thing as blazing as we can. Shout out to Mary Wyatt. It's a UK brand, and I'm using their tote bag as my wood gathering device. Good lord, that's a nice fire. That is a good fire. We found baby spiders, and they're super cute. Only, only problem is it's right on our food block thing. Oops, I forgot that. Oh my god, Scott! No <laughs> on it! What the? <laughs> uh, both of us. Wait, I blew it out the first time. That's awesome. I win. Your team did win. Oh, and your stick broke. Ruined my stick once again. Time to get a new stick. Better do it early, baby. <laughs> yes. <laughs> You want to use my stick for now? For the video's sake? Okay, fine. I guess. Let's just use it. Ew, this has hot dog sauce on it. <laughs> this is the best s'more I've ever had. I'm never, ever, ever going back to regular s'mores ever again. So you have a waffle cone for ice cream, a knife and some Nutella, and a marshmallow, and a fire. Take your Nutella, spread it on the inside. Spread, spread, and spread. You gotta spread it. Alright, we're doing spread this right burnt again. Yes, wait, don't turn it upside down, turn it upside down. There we go. You have to let you it. You want me to let it do its course, take yeah. its course? Really? Yeah. It's fascinating. Now we wait. <laughs> so I already found a tick on me. We'll see how this goes. We're gonna check each other for ticks. I am gonna go find another stick for you. Thank you, sir. Ooh. Do I have baby spiders all over me? No, uh, I don't think so. You hopped over it mostly. Are you sure? I mean, mostly. <laughs> could, could you like get a stick to knock that down and throw it in the fire? Oh uh, yeah. This was an incredible experience. Look at how big that marshmallow got. It used to be Rose's favorite thing as a kid was to put the marshmallows inside of a microwave and watch them like explode in the microwave. Like they just keep growing. Hello everyone, we are in our tent and Scott is holding up a, a propane heater. We're not gonna like lay in here with it. He's holding it up to fill the tent with warmth so that we can just lay in here more comfortably.
That'd be cool if we floated away like a hot air balloon. <laughs> <laughs> Got too hot in here. We're just like... Uh, heat really does rise. And now, yeah. touch this. Like, all the cold is coming from the ground and all the heat is rising to the very top. Oh my god. This is cool. I could vlog us. Look at my white boy. I'm a, I'm a boy. I'm white. I'm wearing all white. You're wearing all white right now. I'm like... Scott, have you ever seen me in all white? No, nope, because you're an uh, Indian. You're a... Uh, Did you just call me an Indian? I wish I thought of vlogging last night because I wish I could have captured how awesome the rain sounded. But yeah, it rained um, for a good amount of time. And it was really cool. Hold. We're gonna try to go out there to make a fire before it rains again at 11 a.m. It's now 7.30. These things kept me warm all night. These are toe warmers and I had some hand warmers. I put the toe warmers in my socks and the hand warmers on my waistband at my um, like back dimple area. Don't know what else to call that. My penis hole. <laughs> You put a hand warmer on your penis hole. No, please don't. That would be so... <laughs> well, these things get really hot. So I, I woke up and eventually tore them out of my body, but... Um, I thought you were going fire. Yeah, he was like, your back was insanely hot. Well, I feel like we're like in the war or something. You've got like everything set up. <laughs> that was such a weird comment. Like, I did not explain anything. <laughs> I feel like we're in the war. <laughs> You've got stuff next to you. Have you seen that video of the guy who like walks up to a tree and he's like, you can tell this is a blah, blah, blah pine because of the way it looks. And he just walks away. <laughs> I'm gonna start this fire. The one toilet paper you give me is wet. <laughs> Most of it's dry, so it'll work. Oh my god, it's already smoking. I haven't even lit it yet. It's smoking and I haven't lit it. That's crazy. What do you think, Scott? Real good. Real good? Real good. Yeah. It just started raining an hour earlier than it predicted. Actually, about, about 9.20. But it was supposed to start raining at 11 to 2. You know, we don't know when it's gonna end. We were able to eat breakfast, thankfully. Our coffee is still too hot because the thermoses that Scott got were so incredibly efficient at preserving the heat. It's taken about two hours for it to cool down and we still can't even touch it to our lips. So it rained from 9.30 to about three, we're assuming. We slept the whole time it rained. Yeah. And it is the most relaxing thing ever to nap under a tent when it rains. We're like just yawning, we have foggy heads. All the birds are coming out, it's great. <laughs> yep, this campsite is definitely for spoiled girls like me because look at this bathroom. 
This is so crazy. This is like a really nice bathroom for just being in the middle of the woods. Only because this is the first time I've ever camped. So Scott felt like it was safe enough to bring me somewhere that people regularly camp versus being out in the middle of a national park where no one's really in charge of us, you know? Yeah, I found a little stream. Um. Can you guys see this like indent in the forest floor? Well, there's like basically the shape of a body right there. And I just think it's so crazy because it's like, you cannot ever make me assume that's not a dead body buried there. 